what's up you two welcome to a whole nother video as you can see i am going to be installing my new spark plugs and my new map sensor this is a two bar this is the map sensor that the tuner recommended and he also told me to gap these to uh, 0 0.024 if i ain't mistaken so we're going to gap all these uh, we got our old uh spark plugs out it was pretty a pain with this uh new set of manifold i got but we end up making it work and uh, we're just gonna pop this bass sucker back inside on the back side. These are our temporarily old spark plugs. I had got these. I thought these was the spark plugs I needed. Uh, the radium. Uh, this is our old map bar sensor. So we're gonna go ahead and you know try to put in a new one. All right, guys. So this is the part number <clears throat> for the map sensor. Need it. Mind you, I'm running everything off stock and stuff, so we ain't going uh, too crazy or nothing. But this is stuff he uh, recommended. Uh, he a well-known tuner too, um, around uh, my area. So thankful uh, to the people who recommended me uh, to him. All right, guys. So I checked my gap. It's uh, within the specs of a uh, 0.024, um, just somewhere about right there. But it's in spec. Uh, so I'm finna throw these uh, spark plugs in. All right guys, so I started off with uh, the easiest one that's towards the back on the passenger side of the motor. Uh, so we got seven more to do. Uh, I have verified all my um, gap was uh, 0 0.24 uh, that the tuner said I should have it up. Um, and yeah, it came out uh, pretty fine. Also, there's some extra stuff, like this new uh, wiring loom to clean it up, as you can see. Um, so I'm gonna clean everything up. So we need to get all these spark plugs in. I'm thinking about putting these boot covers on these bad boys here uh, to prevent it from heat, but they thick as hell though. And uh, hopefully it don't rain on me either. All right, guys, y'all can't really see, but we do have all our spark plugs in. Uh, it was pretty difficult, especially on this side uh, where the turbo is, but we ended up getting it. I made sure everything was tight. Uh, this wrench right here, this three quarter wrench came in handy where I needed to get in tight uh, spaces to make sure it was tight. But other than that, man, this thing is actually looking pretty good. So I was debating on putting uh, the sleeves on because these are some thick thick material um but i might end up putting uh, the boots on and it's storming out here really bad y'all might not can see it the world she's really going like that but well, yeah right there all right y'all can't see but it's trees and all that is blowing the power head got knocked out too anyway i'm gonna put these old ones well these fairly new ones uh in the uh new boxes like this one and let's go from there oh guys i forgot to mention harbor so guys on this part i don't know what happened but i apparently got a bucket um from harbor freight for spending over 30 dollars so i'm afraid i was kind of clutch uh, but i don't know what i was particularly talking about in the scene but uh i guess let's just continue with this video guys don't mind my ripped up seat so this, uh, ugh, I can't even talk. This is, right here, is our older uh, map sensor. As you can see, it got a garment on here, right? Now, this is the new one. And this is how it exactly came, no garment. So let me know if I could take this garment off and put it in there or do I have to order a whole new garment? I was gonna go to the Chevy dealership to see if they uh, carry the garment or whatever and uh, just go from there. And it's really blowing, so I'm gonna just edit this video and uh, get it out, but that's pretty much it. Guys, it's really storming really bad. Like, bro. Anyway, so we got our injectors, uh, well, I'm talking about injectors. We got our spark plugs in. Um, I'm gonna see what I wanna do with uh, this boot. Uh, do I wanna slip it over, which I might end up doing. Only thing we have to do now is just our uh, fuel injectors, clean up everything under here. 
as you can see, I got uh, a nice wiring harness and all that uh, going through that little loom. I'm gonna just clean this bad boy up. I'm going to hook up my uh, intake uh, sensor. Uh, so we're not going to be uh, using this doodle microphone. What's up? One, two, three. One, one, two, one, two, one, two, three. look at my oh my gosh anyway guys that would be it for the tahoe stay tuned for more videos and uh see y'all thanks for the love and support thank y'all see y'all